Ati, of course we eat leftovers. We eat until it's finished. No throwing away food in this house. I read to the social here, I want to thank everybody who have been supporting me, sharing my videos, uh, encourage me to keep on giving me tips, commenting, sharing, subscribing. Asante sana. Nevegyo mono. Thank you very much. Danke. Shun. I'm going to show you what I cook or what we eat in a week. So today is on Monday, 25, uh, 29th of um, September. And this week I'm going to start with uh, African food. I have crante here. I have um, chickpeas. Um, I have, um, what is it called, mincemeat and tomato. So I have cooked my, my onions till golden brown. So I'm going to fry uh, my chickpeas. The chickpeas I boiled on Saturday. So it's just um, going to take me some few minutes to cook it. Yeah. And here I'm warming the oil and I'm going to test if the oil is enough, um, is hot enough. I'm just going to pick one plantain and put inside and see how it's going to react. I think it it needs some. Here I also have a hot pan. I think it's too hot, but it's not a problem. So I'm going to put my minced meat. Meat, minced meat balls. And then I'm going to put it on a low heat. Two or three. And so by the way, I just came from jogging. That's why I look like these. Huh? So my oil is hot enough. So I'm going to put my plantain inside. I'm going to put enough because I have enough oil inside there. Then I'm going to take on my meat balls. I'm going to turn the food have garlic or ginger or turmeric and yeah. So when I go to Kenya, I try as much to get spices back uh, from back home. I get spices from the market, direct from the market. Yeah, most of the spices I buy from Kongoya Market in Mombasa. It's really nice place to buy the spices. So I'm going to spice my chickpeas. So I'm just going to put on black pepper. A little bit of black pepper. See how mini sana. Then um, I'm going to put um, garlic powder and um, I have this still original pack from Kenya. I have to turmeric, a little bit of turmeric. Yeah, and then I'm going to stir it, stir them together. My chickpeas is looking yummy. So I'm going now to put uh, tomatoes inside. Let me show you a closer look of it. So this is the chickpeas. Look how it's looking yummy. So I'm just going to put my tomato, fresh, fresh tomatoes. And my plantain is still cooking on oil. And then my meat, my meatballs, you can see. 
is still cooking on low heat. So my plantain is done. My chickpeas also, so I can put the heat off. off. So. So that's the first meal of the week and you are going to eat this for today and tomorrow the same tomorrow of course I'm going to warm it and chickpeas, plante and meatballs welcome that's the first meal of the week prante meatballs and chickpeas and i'm hoping you're going to enjoy cooking the same recipe please if you do so don't forget to tag me share this video subscribe if you have not done so this is day one of Hope you're keeping to today is day two of my cooking is on Tuesday 29th of September So today we're going to eat leftovers from yesterday, but we ate the pranty all of the pranty So I'm just going to boil some rice and then we eat with the uh, With the chickpeas and the meatballs that I made yesterday, but today I'm going to make a hot pepper sauce because normally I make hot pepper sauce and it takes me like for five or six weeks depending whether my friend come and take some with them or depending my friend Liz makes also this sauce so sometimes I just go there and pick some sauce but now since two weeks I don't have it and last Friday I went to Alfro shop and I got myself um, some hot pepper so I'm going to make a sauce out of them and this sauce will be eating with it most of the food yeah my hubby lamb. Now I have cut and washed everything. My tomatoes are here, paprika and ginger. And here, because I hate cutting onions, I have my iron. I put them here and then they're good to go. I have washed also and cut my pepper in big pieces because I'm also going to uh, brain them. So I'm going to start with my, how my onions are. Yeah. So my oil is here eating. Just put my onions there. So the onions is cooking in hot oil. So in the meantime, I'm going to put half of the tomato sauce here. And put my um, pepper I don't want to touch them with my fingers because if I forget and then put them on the eyes it's dangerous uh, 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 <coughs> I've started sneezing oh god it's too hot so this is my mix so I'm just uh, to cook it I'm waiting for my onion to get cooked and then uh, I'll just put the mix in there wait for it to cook add some salt then I'm good to go most of the people also take pili pili or this uh, hot pepper sauce they eat it like that but me I love cooking it in oil then I put them eat in containers and I preserve it in the freezer and I can eat it for longer time so my onions are done so now i'm going to i have put on inside our spices oh, it was almost burning because of my tea no so now i'm going to put my mix inside you have to put a pretty good amount of oil
I have warmed yesterday leftovers, chickpeas and meatballs will be served with rice and hot pepper sauce stamped inside here. Day two dinner, rice with chickpeas, meatball, and pepper sauce. Kali Bumi.